How to interact with your Kubernetes cluster? Well, for this, you will be using the Kubernetes command line interface called kube control, kubectl, kubectl, no matter how you call it, it's your own choice. But let's see together how we can use this command line tool. So this command line tool, kubectl, is just a wrapper around the API of Kubernetes. And everything that is exposed by the API, you can use it with your kubectl tool, like getting info about your cluster, for instance, OK, or getting info about any resource that you deployed. Of course, you can create a namespace with that. You just say kube control create namespace myspace, and that creates your new namespace. And then you have to go into the context of this namespace, and for that you can, for instance, config set context current namespace myspace, and now you are in the correct context of the new namespace that we just created. From there, you can do whatever you want, like, for instance, creating a new deployment. kubectl create deployment my app with this running image. There we go. And we should see here a pod getting created because the deployment was created, creating a replica set, and the replica set created my pod. OK? Uh, what can I do else? Well, I can scale my deployment. For instance, I just created this deployment, I can say kubectl scale my deployment to two replicas. And just by passing this, I can scale up my application. Of course, I can also, for instance, create a service for my deployment with my kubectl command. For that, I do kubectl expose, deployment my app, the port, and what type of service I want. And if I do that, a new service will be created, kubectl get service, we should see our service here, OK? And if I do kubectl describe, I can describe any resource. So for instance, I can describe my service, my app that I just created. And that will give me all kind of information. And you can see here, I got two endpoints that are the two endpoints of my pod. That's all. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like this video and to subscribe to the channel.